Moving on <laughs> to uh, the Express, and uh, they have a, and also another familiar and chronic story. That's right. Why UK's four hundred million pound deal to stop the boats is doomed. So the the, the Express has done this two week investigation in France. They have talked mm-hmm. to different fr- French policemen, as we can see also on the on the front page. We have the picture of French um, policemen basically looking on as this uh, dinghy full of immigrants uh, sets out for for British shores. Mm. Uh, the Express describes these uh, French uh, police officers with indifference, uh, sentimentality, uh, and also brazen contempt for the fulfillment of their role. Essentially, they have been telling, uh, under the condition of anonymity, of course, mm. they've been telling the Express uh, journalists that, you know, this is not our main issue. Our main issue is security in France. And, uh, you know, we are human as well. We have hearts. And this is, of course, all the more uh, uh, egregious because they are being funded by British, British taxpayer following this right. 480 million pound deal yeah. with the French. So really, their responsibility, their their allegiance should be to us. Exactly. Yeah. I mean, now, say, that was never going to work, was it? <laughs> <laughs> say whatever you want about Gaddafi, but in those years when Italy was p- paying him to keep Absolutely. the migrants at bay, he did a good job. Absolutely. Before he correct. was toppled by the. And the EU are still trying to maintain, uh, you know, a certain amount of, of, of pressure on the North African leaders. I think at this point, but yeah, that was the great catastrophe. Without any question. I don't think many people realised that at all at the time, did they? I mean, British citizens probably were oblivious, I think, to the, to the role that Gaddafi was playing. Well, the Italians did realise that. That's why they didn't participate the in, did. the, in the operation. But the French, yeah. the British and Obama did. Yeah, absolutely right. Well, that's in the past. That can't be undone. But um, it does seem to me that if we're going to pay them half a, half a billion quid, we should expect a decent service. What, what do you think, because we've talked about this a number of times, what yeah. is the answer? Because whatever is like happening doesn't seem to be working. No. So I like gunboats in the channel. That's what it'll come down to sooner or later. Maybe joint patrolling with them, <laughs> yeah. as Italy used to do with Albania and yeah. Libya. No, they would have to patrol them. But they, they, but even at this point, if they capsize five miles out of Calais, they get brought to to, to England anyway, don't they? So. Um... There's, there's obviously no will to stop it, in, in truth, at the moment. It's all entirely cosmetic, isn't it? That's how it seems to me. There doesn't seem to be any real determination to, to stop it at all. It just seems to be going on and going on yeah. and going on.